Hi, I'm Rachel Lynn, and I am on a journey to get out of my student loan debt and lose some weight along the way. Today is Money Monday, and this is the day of the week where I tell you everything that I spent in the week before. So if you are interested in either getting out of debt or losing weight or both, because they definitely go hand in hand, go ahead and click that red subscribe button down below. So like I said, this is Money Monday and I am going to tell you everything that I spent in the previous week. This holds me accountable for my spending and keeps me on track with my budget and I have definitely noticed a huge difference in my spending since telling you everything that I spend. And I actually notice myself sometimes like, oh, maybe I should not stop at this restaurant and buy this food because I'm going to have to tell you about it and I uh, definitely shouldn't eat it because of my calorie budget and uh, just like, it's it's... It's nice to be held accountable sometimes, especially when things are really, really hard. So my week goes from Saturday to Friday of the previous week. This keeps the weekend together, which I feel like holds me a little bit more accountable, and it also gives me a little bit of time to put it up on YouTube for you. I tell you everything that I spent, whether it is on my card, in cash, or even on gift cards. So this is more information than my budgets give because cash and gift cards don't go through my budget. And then my budgets actually have more information than Money Mondays because I don't tell you on Mondays things that come out of my bank account automatically or bills or anything regular like that. So I encourage you to check out both Money Mondays and Financial Fridays where I go over budgets. Alright, so let's go ahead and get into my spending from the previous week. On Saturday, May 18th, I spent, I think it was $8.50, it was somewhere around there, at Churchill Downs for lunch for myself while I was working. I typically spend more like $5, but I got something different just because I was kind of sick of the same thing over and over. Um, so I did spend a little bit more, but um, it was really good. What did I have anyway? It was really good. Oh, I had some kind of like barbecue or something, so it did cost a little bit more, but it was worth it. It was actually lower calories than the other thing that I normally get. On Sunday, May 19th, I spent nothing. On Monday, May 20th, I spent nothing. On Tuesday, May 21st, I spent $11.50 at McAllister's. I paid this in cash because I gave it to a co-worker. She was going to pick up lunch for all of the kindergarten teachers and assistants. And um, we, our kids left really early that day because we had to, like a kindergarten um, you know, ceremony celebration kind of thing. And so um, afterwards we all had a meeting that we were supposed to be at and so we were gonna eat lunch first. And so she went and got it, so I had to pay in cash. Then that night, I also had um, an incoming kindergarten thing. This is something that I was doing back in the winter, and we had one more kind of last minute one um, before the end of the year, and that was that night. And so then afterwards, we went out to dinner, and I spent $17 out at Fiesta time and had dinner with some other coworkers. On Wednesday, May 22nd, I spent nothing. On Thursday, May 23rd, I spent $11.35 at Starbucks on a gift card that was um, drinks for myself and then also my assistant on the last day of school. I also spent $25.34 at Marathon for gas and I put that on my card. On Friday, May 24th, I spent nothing. So that is all of the money that I spent this past week. I think I did pretty well. I know I ate out a lot, but I hadn't been eating out much the rest of the month, and I still have money left over for this last week of May. I would like to know from you, what is something that you spent money on this week? Leave me a comment down below and let me know. Also, don't forget to like this video and also share it with somebody else that is trying to get out of debt or lose some weight. That's all I have for today. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Um, the rest of them. Whoa! I didn't even know it was supposed to rain today.